it comes to soups, I find the egg drop soup very soothing and comforting and it's one of the simplest soups out there. This recipe requires chicken stock and I'm going to show you a very simple homemade chicken stock and using this chicken stock, I'm going to show you how to make the egg drop soup. First, I'm going to show you how to make chicken stock. For this, I've taken 250 grams of chicken with bone. It's best to get chicken pieces with bone on it because most of the flavors come from the chicken bones. Add four cloves of garlic pound, one large onion roughly chopped, two medium sized carrots roughly cut up, two celery stalks roughly cut up, one bay leaf, one teaspoon whole peppercorns and one teaspoon rock salt. You can adjust the salt according to the taste. Saute it for about a minute. You can either add whole peppercorns or crushed pepper. One and a half liters of water. Bring this to a boil and reduce the flame to a low. Let the stock simmer for at least about an hour. The chicken stock has been simmering for about an hour. Turn off the stove. Remove the chicken pieces from the stock. These aren't really good to eat after it's been cooking for about an hour as all the nutritional value has been cooked out of them. So it's best to discard them. Strain the chicken stock and using the chicken stock, I'm going to make a very delicious, simple egg drop soup. Chicken stock is now ready to be used in your recipes. You can store this in an airtight jar for up to two weeks in the fridge and up to six months in the freezer. Now let's start making the egg drop soup. Pour the chicken stock back into the pot. Add finely minced ginger, one teaspoon. Quarter cup thinly sliced spring onion whites. To this add two teaspoons of light soy sauce. Now you can adjust the soy sauce according to taste. Give it a quick stir. Let the stock come to a boil. Meanwhile, crack open four eggs in a bowl and whisk it nicely. The soup has come to a boil. Now I'm going to add the whisked eggs. You must use a fork or a ladle simultaneously while adding the eggs to the boiling soup. Make sure while adding the eggs into the soup that you stir it only in one direction. Add the spring onion greens and turn off the stove. Season it with salt and pepper according to taste. Let the soup sit undisturbed for a few seconds to finish cooking the eggs. Serve immediately topped with some chopped spring onion greens. Season it with some salt and pepper if required. So here's a delicious egg drop soup that's definitely very light on the stomach with a silky smooth egg curd. So do try this recipe and enjoy it. You can get a copy of our first edition of the home cooking book on Amazon and 21 Frames.